All right, are we on? We're on. Hello, everybody. That's my second game today. I'm playing Tyler again from Florida. Uh, he was the regional champion down there. Looks like he's playing Greyjoy Seastone Chair. I uh, haven't seen that one in a while. Um, they do have a few good nobles. Um, I'm guessing Asha will be his restricted. I probably got the Spar and Infinite Theon. Uh, I've got a great setup hand here. I almost feel dirty doing this. It's six cards. I think in the interest of... Well, he set up five too, so I don't feel so bad. Yeah, I'll throw all these out here. I'm saying I might hold one back just so this game is a little even-sided, but uh... Let's see, I think that should be... yeah, that's six gold. I'll flop them all first just to double check. I don't want to screw this up here. Yeah, that's five gold. Six cards, five gold. Uh, but I don't feel bad. Um, this is going to be pretty decent. He's flipped Bay of Ice, and I have mostly high claim or high initiative plots in here. Uh, drawn back up into Jamie and Preston uh, and Alaris, so that'll be nice. Uh, and another gold roll. Always good to see early. Um, what do I want to go with here? Retaliation. Uh, looks like he's playing Choke and Winter since he's got the Ice Fisherman. Maybe I want to go with Fury of the Lion. Or maybe I want to save that gold for later when I need it. Hmm. Let's go with Retaliation. Although, now that I think about it, if he makes it Winter, yep, I'm going to lose a gold there. Because he's going to go first, make it Winter, and then I'll get one less gold. Although I do get Bay of Ice, uh, which is nice. Yep. Now I'm regretting not going first with the Fury. I got my standard draw two. Guild Hall should be good. Let's see, Seastone Chair lets him choose one of the following. Claim a power, add two gold to your treasury, or draw one card. Um, I don't have any cancel for that, or I do? Yeah, I've got Iron Throne. Cancel that all day long. Let's see if he's got a Seasick or something. No, I've got Sunset Sea, so that wouldn't even help him. Um, didn't he just play the gatehouse? Yeah. Two limited cards, bro. I usually don't play more than one King Smoot hopeful in my deck just to avoid that problem. Although it is hard to pass up that three strength intrigue icon out of Greyjoy. Okay, I'm going to count four gold here because of winter. He did not get a wintertime marauder. Oh, that was dumb of me. Should have played the golden tooth mines first, not the gold road. Yeah, I'm an idiot. All right. Um, is it worth playing the golden tooth mines here? I can't play it and Preston, so what am I going to do? The only other military icon I've got is Tywin, and he costs four gold. Ugh, yuck. Yeah, I don't even know here. This is a rough spot. Um, really want to get that Golden Tooth Mines out there. But then I'm not going to win a military challenge if I do. And it's two claimer. Alright. 
I hate to do this. That gold I lost from the ice fisherman really hurt. Uh, don't make the same mistake I did, guys. You make your first action something that costs a lot of gold when they have an ice fisherman. Um, what am I going to do for my last gold? Penny, I guess. See if he has an action in challenges before I do Penny. wisely knelt the carrion bird, because all it means is that I'm going to get an unopposed power. Okay, unopposed military. Uh, I'll kill the Doubting Septa, obviously. Got a Brigands, which is good, but expensive. I probably won't even get to play them in this game. We'll do the two claim intrigue first, and hopefully he doesn't have any tricks to stop that. Now he didn't get a noble out this turn. So no one to use the sea stone chair on. He's lost a newly made lord, that's nice. Two newly made lords. Oh, that's just bad luck. For him anyways. Good for me. Uh, everything is going my way so far today. Do the two claim military and wipe off a couple dudes. I wonder if he considered shuffling the ravens back. I probably wouldn't have. The same one's gonna die here. Yeah. Looks like his dom. I got an unopposed power, so I'll add it now. And Renown. Yeah, I'll forget Renown on Tywin a lot. Okay, next plot. Um, wonder if I can try and sneak by another initiative win here. Maybe go with Cersei's scheme. Or do I want to just use the Fury and blow all my gold now, get that Golden Tooth Mines and Jamie and Preston out there? Let's do that. Alright, so he wins initiative. Uh, but his plot doesn't do anything. He's letting me go first. Some more economy, that's good. Let's see, I'm going to count six gold. Um, I'm going to be able to play the Golden Tooth Mines and one card into Shadows. Go ahead and do the Ice Fisherman now. Yep. River Row will help me out next turn. So what do I want to do with my three gold left? I could enemy and former the Carrion Bird. Could put Preston into shadows. Could put Guildhall into shadows. I think I like the sound of that. Although if he has another way to steal gold, that would be bad. Too late now. If he brings out another ice fisherman, I'm kind of screwed. He's counting seven gold, is that right? I think he counted an extra gold.
Okay, I think we're straight now. Maybe. He had the one from Ice Fisherman, and then he counted six more. I think it should have only counted five more. In any case, it won't really matter except maybe for Dom. Victorian with the guild hall. And then we'll kneel be hopeful with Penny, or we'll try to at least. I think he'll discard a card from his hand, probably. Yeah, discarded another hopeful. Okay. Um. I can't use the Westerlands to touch the Seastone Chair because it's immune. Um, this doesn't hurt him, I don't think. No, it hurts Martell and Stark. Let's see if he blocks this or lets it go through. What do I get for claim? Support of the kingdom. Okay, good. It's a sigh of relief, although he was going to have to choose between power and intrigue then to play it, so. Um, yeah, I'll win military here. That annoying ice fisherman is gone. And I'm done with challenges. He's doing power, so he's probably got what another support of the kingdom. From... Okay. Yep, draw with the chair, sure. He did power. Draw with Septa again. Uh, I wish I'd gotten that before. I wish he'd done the military challenge first. Oh well, I'll have it for next turn. Um, I really don't think he has that gold, but fine. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I can't count. Okay, I've got eight cards in hand, but I need more gold to play them. What do I want to do here? Aftermath looks decent. Stop him from playing any more guys, maybe one initiative, and then I can pop a guy out of shadows. Play like the Informer and Preston. That would work. He's one initiative again, uh, but I'm going to get to go first. I guess I should say that before I draw. Ooh, a house divided could be big here. Alright, I'm going to count four gold. Because of winter, I'm going to spend two of that to put Preston into shadows. And then I'm going to bring out 
the enemy informer. And I think I want to nail his noble crest here. Can use the guild hall to deal with Victorian. And then I'll use uh, Harry the Riverlands to deal with whatever else he has. You know what, I forgot my Golden Tooth Mines. Uh, I don't want to go back and try and draw that now, it's a little late. Forgot I'd played it, honestly. River Blockade. Alright, thankfully I'd already triggered my River Row, or that would have been bad. He would have had Victorian to get through a Claim 3 military challenge. That would have been really bad. Let's see if he forgets the aftermath and plays another character. Maybe he's willing to play another character and let the carrion bird go. Yep. Alright, he's got one gold left. Let's go, the guy who's knelt. His only or I guess he's got another noble crest now, so now I gotta choose between kneeling Baylor and Kneeling Victorian. Well, now I can kneel Baylor with uh, Harry the Riverlands. And actually, that was an Ironborn. I should have played House Divided, too. I'm forgetting all kinds of triggers today. Um, but sure, I think I want to do that. Especially since he's got claim, too. Try and kneel the carrying bird too, sure, why not? Okay. Intrigue first, almost always. Not in every situation, but usually. He loses a nice fisherman, awesome. Kill the carrying bird, of course. Power is unopposed, and we'll put Preston back in shadows. Alright, so things are looking pretty good here. Um, I don't think he'll be able to Valar next turn. Because um, he would have very low gold then. Um, do I want to bring Preston out to win Dom? Yeah, sure. That'll put me at 8. Sweet. And then pre-plot next round. I'll put Preston back if that's okay with him. Should have stood everybody first, I guess. All right. Um, let's go Cersei's scheme just to try and win initiative again. I doubt it'll work. Uh, might have like a four or five initiative plot though. I guess he's got two Bay of Ices. Now there's no way I'm gonna win this. Probably should have just gone with summoned. Yeah. Well, I've got more characters than I can afford already. Not a huge difference either way. Um, I'll make sure he gets prized one from the aftermath. He's going first. Uh, he's drawing for Bay of Ice. I've drawn another Harry from the Riverlands. Excellent. And a cheap guy, perfect. You don't get much better than zero cost. He's 
counted four gold again. Then he put it down to three, so maybe he remembered. Okay, so yeah, there's Asha. Uh, he brings out three characters. Ouch. Uh, I can heal Asha and the refugee, though. Alright, so how much gold do I get? Four. And then... River Blockade cancels that. You know what? He played another Ironborn, and I forgot Harry or House Divided again. Could have bounced for Terry in there. Maybe I should just take that card out if I'm never going to remember it. Um, Alright, four gold. I can play Alaris and Ashmark Counselor, maybe. Looks good to me. And do I want the refugee? He still hasn't shown me any saves, so I'm not too afraid of too afraid of a valor. Let's bring out Preston and Neil Victorian one more time. take care of his non-kneeler and his refugee. Ah, nice. I forgot about that. Baylor does something. Alright, we'll do Penny then. Um, try and kneel Asha, of course. So Asha hasn't turned on yet, so at least there's that. And that's his last support of the kingdom. Okay, let's see if I can withstand this. He's got two claim on any unopposed challenge. Um, he's got one instance of stealth, uh, but otherwise no keywords I have to worry about. No challenges? Is that what he's saying? Why? Okay, he's conceding, I guess. Um, yeah, I had, a, I had a pretty good start there. Um, Golden Tooth Mines and his Bay of Ice is canceling out. Um, and I got enough economy to uh, get through his choke, which wasn't quite enough. All he had was the White Raven. Um, that Ice Fisherman and Newly Made Lord got discarded. So that was Lanny Neal doing his thing against Greyjoy, uh, as usual. Pretty good matchup, usually, for Lanny. Um, although the shadows in Lanny can get pretty expensive, uh, so sometimes it doesn't work out. I lost with my Lanny No Agenda at Worlds last year during Greyjoy Choke deck, uh, fairly similar to this one, although I wasn't using the Sea Stone Chair. I think it was Song of Ice. But uh, thanks for watching, guys, uh, and I'll have this one. I get the games up usually about an hour after they actually stream.